Hi guys, for your art today, you are going to be making a cute little caterpillar, but we are not going to be using pens or pencils or coloring pencils or paint or recycled materials or even material like this caterpillar is made from. We're going to be using something else. Let's have a look. We're going to be using some fruit and some vegetables today. So you are going to need a banana, some cucumber, strawberry, orange or satsuma, an apple, and sweet corn, or you can have raisins, or you can have uh, little chocolate drops. You don't have to use these exact vegetables or fruit. You can use your own ones, whatever you've got in the house will do. I'm just gonna show you how to do the caterpillar like this. You're also going to need to have a chopping board and you're gonna need your grown up with you as well because we are going to be cutting things with a knife. It is up to your grown up whether or not you're allowed to cut your fruit and vegetables so make sure you listen to them very carefully and do not use the knife when they are not there. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to have my plate on here too so I can put things straight on the plate when they're done. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to slice up my banana. So let's peel it. And very thin slices. got my banana slices ready, I'm going to slice up my cucumber. You don't need the end. Now that's the cucumber ready, we're going to do the apple. The apple's going to be a bit trickier, so I'm going to cut the apple in half first. And then I'm going to turn it so it's flat like this. And I'm going to cut one side off and turn it round and then cut the other side off. Now I've made like a section this big. And I'm going to slice that up. Remember to keep your fingers away from the knife as much as possible. Keep yourself safe. Okay, now I've got all of these bits, I need to put them together to make the caterpillar. So we're gonna start with banana, cucumber, apple, banana, and just keep going. the little cucumber head and we can very carefully try and balance some sweet corn on top for the eyes. Let's see how it goes. Oh, there's a cute little caterpillar. Make him a bit more wiggly. When you're happy with your caterpillar, we're going to make a little flower just underneath them as well. So this is where we're going to use our strawberry.
now what we can do, using the rest of the apple, we can make something that looks a bit like grass. So you're going to need your grown-up to help you again. If you've got a spare piece of apple, you can start by cutting that. And we're just going to cut it in very thin strips. And then you're going to cut the middle bit away. Now see if you can use any bits you have left just to fill your picture up. See if you can make it look really full of flowers and grass and whatever else you When you're done, Take a photo, see if you can put it on Twitter for us so we can all have a look. Well done, guys. Now, you don't have to do a caterpillar like this. You could do a sandwich that looks a little bit like a bear. You could use any of the pictures in the plan and make whatever it is you want. But if you want to do one like this, this is the way to do it. Otherwise, have a really good fun lesson arranging your fruit and don't forget to eat it all up when you're done. Yeah.